I got invited to NBA 2K24 Community Day. Wow, that feels good to say. We just hit 800,000 subscribers and now we got invited to go play NBA 2K24 early in person. So drop a look at the video right now if you want to see early gameplay, quick play, mama moments, the rec center, the builder, and all the things I learned while playing NBA 2K24 this past weekend. And listen, you got to be subscribed with notifications on because I'm going to be dropping crazy info and footage of 2K24 leading all the way up to launch day. But anyways, I did record my experience at 2K24's Community Day in New York. So we're going to go over the vlog and over the entire trip from start to finish so y'all can see what went down. Let's get into it. What is good, YouTube? It's your boy, Henry, a.k.a. Double H. Back at it with yet another banger video, man. And look, y'all, I got y'all with your vlog. Y'all see on the screen. I live in Chicago, right? Community day was in New York, so I had to head to the airport, bro. This was like six in the morning. I got to the airport, right? My flight was at like 8.50, got there a little early, okay? Headed on the plane, went to New York, bro. Oh my, this is my first time I was ever in New York. Let me know if you've ever been to New York, but yeah, New York was a lot like Chicago, pretty similar um, after being there for a couple days. But shout out to 2K for inviting me to 2K24 community day i had a great experience a great time and i cannot wait to tell y'all so basically i got to the airport right bro there was this dude that 2k sent out a chauffeur he was literally carrying my bags this dude had my name on like a uh, a screen literally double h like literally waiting for me he brought me to a car and he drove me over to the hotel that 2k had a staying at bro 2k was paying for our hotel room they were paying for some food they were they were really hooking your boy up okay they were going crazy i cannot lie but yeah you see i had a chauffeur literally drive me to the hotel we were lit it was crazy like 2k really took care of your boy bro shout out to them they couldn't have done a better job to be honest and this was probably i mean i've never been to the community day but this had to have been one of the best community days Ever. I mean, y'all gonna see the vlog. It was fire. But anyways, yeah, we're on our way to the hotel. Which the hotel was really nice too, in my opinion. You see the city, the sky, the skyline. Yo, there's a lot of stuff to talk about in this video. One thing I do want to say while we are on our way to the airport here is that I was not brought here to fix the game. So if months down the line y'all don't like 2K24 or something, it's not my fault. Okay, I didn't make the game. They literally invited me out to make early content and give y'all that content. And we're gonna talk about when I can drop the builders, the build video, you know, the builder breakdown. I'm gonna drop gameplay, mama moments, all types of stuff, gameplay with my build, um, gameplay with just NBA players. It's gonna be fire, okay? But you see, we got to downtown. I got into my room, you know, so nothing crazy, you know, a bed, a bathroom, you know, a desk. I wasn't in here like at all anyways. I, I was out the whole time you know, at community day, doing other stuff with a lot of other creators, bro. I'm not gonna lie, shout out to anyone that I was talking to at 2K24 community day. I met a lot of cool creators there. We were vibing out, it was fire. Y'all gonna see a couple clips, but I met up, the first creator I met up with was my boy Solo, shout out to Solo. We went to like the Nike store. Bro, this Nike store was like five floors big. Uh, they had a crazy selection of stuff. I didn't cop nothing though. We were just looking around. We had just got here at this point, it's like, I said like 1 p.m. Uh, the day before community day. So we just chilling, waiting to see some other creators come by. Uh, a lot of creators showed up. I got like, they invited everybody, bro. Every big creator you could think of, mostly, obviously there's someone, some people that didn't get invited, were there. But anyways, we started to, you know, see some people in the lobby. You see my boy, Brother Jones right there. Antonio, we went to the NBA store, Click Productions right in front of me. Some other big 2K YouTubers, y'all know the, them boys. We were vibing out, went to this NBA store, bro. They had so many jerseys they had a Wemby jersey they had all types of throwback jerseys bro they had everything in this nba store bro this nba store is probably the craziest nba store i've ever been to this thing was literally straight out of 2k dog okay it was crazy they had crazy throwback pistons jerseys bowls nuggets literally every nba team you could think of they had throwback jerseys for now they were low-key taxing I'm not gonna lie, they were low key taxing. I saw a Stephen Curry jersey for $325. I mean, damn. But hey, it is what it is. You know, they're fire jerseys. I can't lie. You see Sean Kemp, they got some Sonics jerseys. I got a lot though. <laughs> Yo, they had a clearance rack. <laughs> Yo, they had a clearance rack, bro. And Carl Malone <laughs> was on the clearance rack, dog. I don't think I got a video of that, but. I swear to God, they had Carl Malone. The only jersey that was on sale was Carl Malone. 
I mean, if you know, you know, I don't got to do much explaining, but if you know, you know, but yeah, we ended up going shopping. My boy, Tonio, we were with Tonio, brother Jones solo. Then everybody showed up here. You see uncle Demi Hollywood. Uh, we got a couple gifts. I'll pop it up on the screen, but then we went out my boy, Cole solo, tough NYC Hollywood, uh, Tonio, we went out to some, we started bar hopping, even LSK was with us, we started bar hopping, went to a club, it was lit, you know what I'm saying, you see us in the Uber, there's my boy LSK, we got Slay with Steve's, Cole and Solo in the car, we were just chilling, we were vibing, okay, we were having a good time, okay, we had to have a good time here, we were in New York, you feel me, we had to go crazy, um, and yeah, it was a lot of fun, bro, but yeah, we, we definitely had a good time, shout out to all the creators once again that I met with, but yeah, this is the night before in my hotel room, I didn't get home until like 2 a.m., I ain't gonna but the next morning, we met in the lobby at 8 a.m. Look at all the creators. There was like 60, 70 people that were invited to the community day. We started to walk into the community day event. Uh, this was next to the hotel. And, bro, we were here. Community day. It's like, I think it was like 8.30 in the morning, something like that. And we here. They had a big screen, bro. When I tell you this venue, whatever they rented out here, was a, was insane. It was massive. I mean, this building was huge. You see, we walked down here. They had a bunch of free food here. They had, a, bro, there were so many people that popped out. Y'all about to see some big names that were there. Like, Adam Silver was literally there, bro. The commissioner of the NBA. But yeah, you see, they got a bunch of posters. They got the community day thing at the top over there. They got some, you know, some consoles. They got some 2K24 on the monitors. Y'all, hey, if y'all see it, y'all see it, okay? Um, but yeah, if y'all are wondering, I did play 2K24 for eight hours. So yeah, I, I saw the builder. I played with my a bunch of builds. I played against other people that were there. You know, we're gonna talk about that in a later video. Stay tuned, make sure you're subscribed. Uh, but yeah, they had a bunch of free food, a bunch of good stuff here. Uh, yeah, shout out to 2K for uh, hooking us up with all this, uh, you know, good stuff. But yeah, we, we did a lot, okay? We played the Mama Moments, we played the Quick Match. There's a special thing in there as well. I think I said in the beginning of the video, if you caught that, you caught it, um, but yeah. Uh, then they, you know, we kind of gathered around, but hold on. Y'all not going to see the screen. We're going to block this off. Okay, but there was monitors over here. I'm not going to show this yet, but uh, yeah, uh, embargo dates are on the screen. August 30th. I can drop gameplay. Make sure you have notifications on 11 a.m. Eastern, August 30th. Okay, 11 a.m. 11 a.m. Eastern again, September 1st. I can drop builder news, okay? So I'm gonna drop gameplay, what was in 2K23 that's not in 2K24, what's looking good in 2K24 gameplay, some crazy clips I got with some NBA players in my build, then I'm gonna drop a bunch of build videos, lockdowns, centers, point guards, my ISO builds. I'm gonna drop builder gameplay against other creators, a bunch of good stuff, okay? But you see, you know, we were chilling at Community Day, they were uh, giving us this little intro, basically telling us what was about to go on uh at q today because at this point we had not played yet so we were just chilling waiting for ronnie to tell us what was up you know what we we're about to do yo so we got all these people at community day right and everybody's chilling eating food and then we got joe locked in staring at that builder and we have not gotten to play the game yet he is ready to go shout out joe shout out joe yeah, shout out Joe, bro. That dude was trying to get on the builder ASAP. Hey, me too. Me and Joe were sitting like right next to each other in the builder. So we were going in the builder deep. We were telling each other, you know, stuff we learned about the builder. We were feeding off of each other's energy, you know, just finding stuff in the builder. So we went crazy uh, testing the game. But y'all going to see that later on. But you see Ronnie just giving us a gist of what's about to happen, telling us, you know, where we can go to play, you know, what's about to happen the next, like, eight hours. Because we were there. The community day was, like, eight, literally eight hours. And, yeah, I played the game the whole time. I ain't gonna lie. I was, I was talking to some people, of course, you know. I'd say, like, an hour or two I spent not playing. But, yeah, there was about eight hours where I was literally playing 2K24. Because you know, I had to give y'all the info, but Mike Wang wasn't there. But he ended up telling us some stuff on the big screen. Nothing crazy. Just about, uh, you know, community day and stuff. Nothing crazy. But, uh... Yeah, we had some quests and stuff that they had us doing. Y'all see this bracket. You know, I ain't going to say too much. But, you know, 2K24 against other creators on the way. They had the finals trophy there. Y'all have more info on that later in a future video. We were playing against other creators. It was fire. Okay. 2K24 uh, community day content is coming soon. And it's going to be lit. August 30th, 11 a.m. Eastern. September 1st, 11 a.m. Eastern. And that's not the only two times going to be uploading. After those days hit 
or those dates hit, I'm going to be uploading a bunch of videos. So expect a ton of content leading all the way up to launch day. And you already know when 2K24 is officially out, your boy's going to be streaming, your boy's going to be uploading a bunch of stuff. But as you can see right here, you know, a bunch of people lined up, bro. Adam Silver pulled up. Like Adam Silver was there. Now, he didn't take a picture with me, bro. I asked him to take a picture and he, he left, bro. Like I, I was literally the next person to take a picture with him. And he dipped out on your boy. Anyways, uh, yeah, we had to, you know, wait for, you know, them to give us the clear to actually uh, play in stuff. You see my boy Duke over there. Uh, and yeah, this is where we tested the game for about eight hours. But I'm not showing y'all anything in there, okay? Remember, August 30th, 11 a.m. Eastern. From there on out, all the way through to September 7th is when I can start posting gameplay. September 1st, 11 a.m. Eastern. From there all the way to September 7th, I can post as much builder stuff as I want. So make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you have notifications on because we're about to be dropping some bangers. Shout out to all the creators I met at Community Day. Y'all were a vibe. I appreciate everybody that I talked to. And shout out to 2K for inviting me to the 2K Community Day. I greatly appreciate the invite. And we got a great year ahead of us. Drop a like, hit that subscribe button. But wait, before I go, I couldn't leave, leave y'all hanging. I can't really tell y'all what I saw in 2K24, what's good, what's bad. I can't really give specific details. But all I'm going to say is the builder, the, well, the eight hours I was on it, okay? It's looking good, okay? I think we have a very balanced builder. I think there's going to be a lot of variety of play styles. You really have to pick and choose what you want to do with the builder. You are not creating no demigod where you're elite in every category like 2k23 that's not happening okay uh the gameplay the drill moves i didn't really get adjusted to the drill moves yet but it's completely different you're not going to hop on 2k24 with that 2k23 mindset with dribbling and be able to just get on there and cook you're going to have to lab up of course and yeah my biggest tip for y'all going into 2k24 everything that you think about with 2k23 builder you know meta doing this and that just throw it out the window okay throw it all out the window okay y'all because that 2K23 mindset is not going to work in 2K24. But anyways, it's me, your boy, Henry, AKWH, and I'll see y'all in the next video.